Welcome back, thanks for watching. Today we're talking about the Zooty Ball Hawk EG808. This Zooty mask, like all the other Zooty masks, are available only for the Verdell Speed Flex. They will work on collectibles and field use. This particular mask is called the Ball Hawk EG808 because, well, it has eye guards and because it has that 808 that we've all grown to love. I really like the way that this looks and I love the design that the guys at Zooty came up with. This visor is a clear shock zero G plus and from what I found, it's the only one that works. I tried to install an Under Armour visor, no good. Try to install an Oakley Pro, no good. This has a pretty large field of vision. Actually, one of the largest field of visions for any Speedflex mask that I've come across. The downfall to that is the Under Armour visor is actually smaller than this opening. The Oakley holes line up all the way out here and it's directly behind those bars. Not gonna work. But the good news is the Shock Zero G Plus visors are already meant for the Riddell Speed Flex, so just stick with what works. This mask, as with all of our masks at GreenGridiron.com, are available in all 35 standard colors. You're seeing this dipped in our silver, which is one of my favorite colors. The unique thing about Zooty masks, if you don't already know, is they are the only face masks that are molded. There are no weld points in this, so you get this smooth, sleek lines without any of the little clunky weld marks because there are none. This is an investment cast. This mask will carry a price tag of 200 bucks, which I think is pretty standard for all of the Zooty masks. It's still under the real high-end custom masks that start at 250 and up, but yeah, it's not for everybody. We put this on a scale and it comes in at 1.3 pounds. So I guess it's on maybe the higher side of the weight, but it's by no means heavy. It's really nice and balanced. Even on this helmet, when you hold it center, it just sits perfectly. Um, the Speed Flex collectible helmets um, have the same padding. These are the real deal. So you really get a feel for uh, the weight distribution and it's outstanding. The overall look of this thing is just aggressive and sharp and yeah, it looks perfect on this Falcon's helmet, but I think that the guys at Zooty did a great job of naming this. I mean, the ball hawk, it looks like a beak. It looks like you're coming for it. And uh, man, I just love it. I think what I should do is put this thing on. Yeah, I tell you, the field of vision is enormous. Even with these eye guards, it doesn't seem to get in the way. Uh, my days of wearing a football helmet on the field are long gone, but I could imagine going out there and being able to see um, the thing just feels great. I don't feel like, like it comes down too far. Um, if you could imagine wearing padding, especially the, some of the younger players out there where they're wearing big gear. Some of the other ones are a little long, I don't feel like this is long at all. It actually follows uh, my jawline pretty perfectly. It's a really, really nice looking mask. If you're looking for an ultra upgrade for your field use or your collectible helmet, these masks are made in Detroit, in the USA. They are just screaming all American. You can find them at greengridiron.com or in Zooty's site. I'll have a link in the video description if you wanna pick one up. I hope that this helps. If there's any other reviews that you wanna see on products that either we sell or don't sell, leave them in the comments below. And until next time, cheers.